Right into those temperatures here tonight. Uh, here at home, uh, temperatures ranging from the upper 40s to upper 50s. Uh, but I want to point something out tonight, and it's not too often that you can clearly see a frontal boundary across the region, but it's hanging out right across northern Ohio. Look at this, 57 at the airport. Erie, Pennsylvania, 39 degrees, 41 up in Ashtabula, and this front just laying right along the turnpike here across northern Ohio and into uh, northwestern Ohio to the south. Warm air, that's where we're going to sit most of the night, and in fact, we're going to warm things on up into tomorrow. Lots of clouds out there, and we'll continue to see these through morning, uh, but just showing you some of those moon pictures. Uh, the clouds are thin in spots and even opening up at times, so uh, just uh, uh, some cloudy skies, and that'll help bring the sunshine out just a little bit uh, tomorrow morning, filtering that sunshine out to the west. Some showers trying to form, and I'm expecting these showers to continue to build eastward as the night goes on. A small chance of showers tomorrow, but a better chance of rain into tomorrow night. So I'm going to spend some time here on Future Tracker to show you how your next couple of days into the weekend goes for you. Uh, by tomorrow morning, there's a small chance for an isolated shower. Temperatures only dropping to around 50 degrees to get the day going, and then to get ready for a nice Nice warm day tomorrow by noon temperatures building into the 60s. The wind will pick up tomorrow. We're going to get some decent wind gusts up above 20 to 30 miles per hour through tomorrow afternoon uh, right into tomorrow evening and a small chance for an isolated shower or even a rumble of thunder later tomorrow. But I'm expecting the heavier rain and the chance of thunderstorms to move in later tomorrow evening and tomorrow night out of the 70s into the 60s. Here's 9 o'clock, and this is what I'm talking about. Uh, I talked about the warm front tonight, the warm air south of it. Tomorrow night, the cold front comes through and temperatures will drop, but along that cold front, I'm expecting a line of heavier rain and the chance of thunderstorms. Now, Future Tracker putting that through here, 9, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock tomorrow evening. If you get stuck underneath some of these storms, the risk is there for some gusty winds. So I'm going to keep a close eye on this line as it moves on through tomorrow night. Behind it, temperatures start dropping fast right into uh, Friday morning. We're going to dip toward the 30s and a few showers around on Friday and then improving weather as we go through the afternoon. High temperatures only in the lower 40s on Friday. But that's the coolest day into the weekend. It gets better Saturday and on into Sunday. 51 tonight, mostly cloudy. Small chance for that isolated shower or sprinkle. And I'm going to leave that small chance in my forecast for tomorrow. 70 degrees tomorrow. Very warm day. The biggest part of the day stays dry across the area. That best chance of rain on into tomorrow night and early Friday morning. Temperatures 40 on Friday. How about Saturday? Partly or mostly sunny skies, upper 50s. Nice way to start the weekend. Most of Sunday stays dry. Late in the afternoon for your Easter day, it looks like a small chance of showers, but a better chance into Sunday night and on into Monday with a small chance of showers. A little cooler, high of 49 on Monday, 50 next Tuesday, and right back into the upper 50s next Wednesday. Overall, a big part of the next seven days staying dry for us. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. 70 tomorrow and then 40 Friday, and then we kind of level off. It does. Yeah. Uh, closer to where we should be, where around we should 50 be. degrees this time of the year. Right. Of the year. Right. Yeah, absolutely. So a little up and down, a little rocky tomorrow night. Going to keep an eye on those storms. All right, Paul, thanks.